Many consumers are interested in gaining a better understanding of financial topics, but are not always sure where to find sources they can trust. MSU FCU Chief Community Development Officer Whitney Anderson Harrell is here to discuss how to educate yourself about financial topics. Good morning, Whitney. Good morning. Good to see you. Good to see you. So what financial topics are the best to address first? You know, when you're trying to understand and manage your finances, I think it's really important to make informed decisions. So when you want to think about these topics, they're things like saving money, budgeting, debt management, investing. But the biggest question that we get is how do I improve my credit score? What are those things that really impact my ability to get a a house, get a loan, do all of these different things. So understanding your credit is one of the main questions that we get. So why should anyone take time to become informed? You know, it's so important to take the time to understand a lot of these financial topics so that you can become a better consumer. That really just means that the more that you know, you understand how to avoid fees, how to make the right loan decisions, not taking on too much debt, but finding that balance of how to live the life that you want to live and make great financial decisions within it. You know, right now with COVID-19, there's been a lot of stress around How do I pay my bills? How do I get things done? But the biggest thing to remember is just try to start with the little things around budgeting and understanding what you can get done on a monthly basis to try to help reduce some of that stress. You know, I understand that financial and and physical well-being are sometimes directly linked. Absolutely. You know, in 2017, there was a study around global health and wealth to really understand how that financial health really impacts your mental health as well. And that's why we just want to take those small steps to understand how do I budget? How do I plan out for things? And if there is financial stress, that really affects you physically as well. So it's important to just at least be informed and start to make a plan. Does MSU FCU offer financial education? Yes, we offer financial education on so many topics. In 2019, we actually started a podcast, which has been an amazing way for our financial educators to have some great conversations. We've brought in different guest speakers, which has been amazing to hear. But we talk about a lot of things like budgeting, different saving strategies. We spotlight different people in the credit union industry, some of our interns, as well as just leaders within the community. We talk about the pros and cons of buying versus leasing a car and understanding the home buying process, which is so important to so many people. You can check us out on iTunes, Spotify, and Podbean. So I really encourage you to just check us out. All right. Well, thank you so much, Whitney.